find the maximum power transfer to resistor R in the circuit of figure. Solution First we will find RTH. So to find RTH Here this will be RTH. We have to find maximum power in this resistor R. So this will be RTH. Now we will turn off all the independent sources. So this is a voltage source. This will be turned off and short circuited. Here we can see this is a dependent source. So to find RTH, we will consider a 1 volt voltage source here. This will be positive, this will be negative. This will be 1 volt. Let's say this is current Ix. So therefore RTH will be equal to 1 volt divided by Ix. Now we have to find this Ix to get the value of RTH. Let's say this is node VO and this is node this will be node of 1 voltage. So let's say this is VA is equal to 1 volt. Let's say this is a reference node. Let's say this is current I1. This is current I2. And this is current I3. This is current I4. So apply KCL at node VO. Now when we apply KCL at node VO, so entering current at this node is 0. So all the currents are leaving. So I1 plus I2 plus I3 is equal to 0. I1 plus I2 plus I3 is equal to 0. Now this I1 is equal to VO minus 0 by 10. VO minus 0 by 10 kilo ohm. So 10k plus I2. I2 is VO minus 0 by 40k. VO minus 0 by 40k plus I3. Now I3 is VO minus 1. VO minus 1 by 20k. VO minus 1 by 20k is equal to 0. Now we have to find the value of VO from this equation. So this will be VO by 10,000 plus VO by 40,000 plus VO by 22,000 minus 1 by 22,000 is equal to 0. So this will be 1 by 10,000. 1 by 10,000 then plus 1 by 40,000 plus 1 by 1 by 22,000 so this will be 170.45 170 0.45 into 10 raised to the power minus 6 VO minus 1 by 22,000 is equal to 0 or directly we can write this is equal to 1 by 22,000 so from this VO is equal to VO is equal to 1 by 22,000 into this so this will be 1 divided by 22,000 into answer. So this will be 0 0.266. 0 0.266 volt is the value of VO. 4 by 15. For more precise, we will write 4 by 15 volt. Now we have the value of VO. From this, we can find the value of IX. So Ix will be equal to
if we apply kcl at node va apply kcl at node va so summation of all the entering current entering current is ix plus i3 ix plus i3 is equal to i4 also this 0 0.003 vo is entering at this node so this will be i3 plus ix plus plus 0 0.003 vo is equal to i4 so this ix as it is plus i3 now i3 is vo minus 1 by 22000 vo minus 1 by 22k plus 0 0.003 vo is 4 by 15 4 by 15 is equal to or minus i4 now i4 is this i4 is 1 minus 0 1 minus 0 by 30,000 1 minus 0 by 30k so this will be ix plus vo is 4 by 15 so 4 by 15 4 by 15 minus 1 divided by 22,000 plus 0 0.003 into 4 by 15 minus 1 by 30,000 is equal to 0 ix and this will be 4 by 15 minus 1 divided by 22,000 plus 0 0.003 into 4 by 15 minus 1 by 30,000 So it is 733.33 plus 733.33 into 10 raised to the power minus 6 is equal to 0. Therefore, Ix is equal to minus 733.33 into 10 raised to the power minus 6 ampere. This is the value of Ix. We have to find Rth. RTH is equal to 1 by IX. RTH is equal to 1 upon IX. So this will be 1 upon minus answer. So it is 1363 minus 1363.63 ohm. This is the value of RTH minus 13.63 minus 1363.63 ohm now this rth is in minus next we have to find vth we have to find the maximum power transferred to register r since the rth is negative Therefore, P max is equal to directly we can say P max is equal to infinite. So, this is our final answer.